based on that rush hour shooting that brought traffic to a standstill on the Niagara section of the thruway last night. We now know it left one driver dead. It happened about six o'clock last night near the Niagara Street exit. And new tonight, police believe that the shooter involved here was on a mission. This was no random act. Here's 7 Eyewitness News reporter Sean Robson. of an automobile that was shot at and drove into the wall. That was one of the police dispatch calls made last night after a driver opened fire around 6.15 on the northbound Niagara Thruway. The shooting caused another driver, a man behind the wheel of this red Civic, to lose control and to crash into the median. He later died at ECMC. Tonight, as state police search for a killer, investigators tell 7 Eyewitness News the victim was targeted. Our preliminary investigation leads us to believe that it was not a random act, that it was not a uh, road rage incident, that it was a targeted uh, incident. So I think we could put the, the public's mind at ease. State police say they have spoken to several other drivers who witnessed what happened. They're now hoping more drivers who were on the 190 last night come forward. But it's certainly unusual for us to have something like this happen in the middle of the day, in the middle of a busy highway in rush hour, you know, where obviously there would be, uh, you know, multiple um, people in that area that, you know, um, potentially watch this and witness this happen. And state police are hoping more witnesses do come forward because as of tonight, they have no suspects and no description of the suspect's car. We are also still waiting for police to release the victim's name. Sean Robson, 7 Eyewitness News.